What's up everybody, Jesse Mails here, BackwaterFlyFishing.com. In this video, sorry if it's a little windy or you could hear some background noise. The wind is freaking crazy today in my house and I got all kinds of trees and stuff brushed up against the house here. So if you hear a bunch of garbage, my apologies. Now one question I wanted to answer today, and it's a question I got asked a lot in the last few years, is why do you make all these fly tying videos? And at first I'd give pretty generic responses, but I wanted to cover that kind of just in a video for you guys. Because um, most people that I know are like, dude, you know, you don't really get a lot of views on these videos. Why you take, you know, five, six, seven hours sometimes work on filming and editing a video, uploading a video, going through all these things to make blog posts and posts on Facebook and all this stuff. So I'm gonna cut to the chase here and I'm gonna answer that question for you guys. Now I wish it was super short. Typically I do give a short answer on this one, but for me, I grew up doing a lot of drawing, doing a lot of coloring, doing a lot of things as a kid. And my family, my brothers, we're always just kind of creating things. Um, when it came to getting into skateboarding, we were building skate ramps. Um, we were building skateboards with our dad. We were, you know, my brother Casey's a great artist even to this day. So art and creation has always been something that I enjoyed. But what I kind of realized was that when I got into fly fishing, part of what was so cool about all those things in my past was being able to share them with people like my brothers or friends that we had over. And it's kind of the same way with fly tying for me. I mean, I could sit in this room and tie some flies, but it's a lot cooler if I could then upload that and share that with you guys and even help maybe educate some people on some fly patterns and materials or things that they didn't even know existed. So in a, in a, in a long word answer, man, that's about it. It's about sharing uh, my passion for fly fishing, which is why I do the fishing videos too my passion for filmmaking, for videos, for photos, for fly tying, all of it is just about connecting with other people that enjoy the same types of things. And in this day and age, luckily, man, this is the way we can do that. We can do it through media. We can do it through YouTube or Facebook or Instagram. And I use all those things. If you follow me around, you know I'm always on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, I'm posting, I'm doing blog posts on the website. You know, I'm writing articles for magazines. I'm guiding people here in Costa Rica uh, on fishing trips. Um, this is what I do and it's something that I like to share with people, you know, and that's part of guiding too even is just we've came we found all these super cool places in the jungle and now we get to take people there and show them what that's all about. So with everything that I'm passionate about, everything that I'm doing, it's about bringing other people into it and sharing those memories, sharing those moments and educating people on different things they may not have even known were out there. So. That's a long word response. Hopefully you guys uh, have that cleared up. And obviously subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, leave a comment. You know the drill. This is YouTube, it's not your first time. So thanks a lot guys for the support. Smash this share button, share it on Facebook, Instagram, wherever you guys could share videos. Please do so, it's much appreciated. Thanks for everything guys. If you enjoyed the video, leave a comment below, let me know what you'd like to see more of fly fishing fly tying material videos just leave a comment below let me know thanks guys tight lines